third day of Intel Extreme Masters Cologne. Gambit Gaming just won the semi-final match against Dignitas and I'm here with Cabocharts. You had a really good uh, game with Are Aurelia. You got an early lead and you managed to snowball it really hard. But other members of your team weren't doing so well compared to their counterparts. Did you feel the pressure on you to perform? Um, no, I think it's alright because Aurelia is the kind of champion in top that can carry the game. So I knew that if my teammates were just doing even, and since I was snowballing super hard top lane, we would win the game. Mm -hmm. uh, in both games, it ca came down to you managing to steal a dragon. In the first game, it was a steal with a pentil ultimate, ultimate, if I remember correctly. And the second one, you just managed to well catch Dignitas doing it. Do you think uh, these engages were the turning point of the game, or was it just um, well, a way for you to finish the game easier? Um, I think we put them under pressure so they had to do risky dragon call or natural calls and that's what caused them the game. The second game for sure the natural call uh, gave us, like we, we had the game after we killed them all at natural. Mm -hmm. well, I don't know how much do you want to talk about your composition in game two but I reckon that's something you prepared beforehand. Well, let's not talk about the specifics but how well do you think you have executed the strategy? Um, I think we, we had the plan in, in our head, but we did kind of different, but it still worked out pretty well. Like um, In pick and ban, we knew what they would pick, and we knew what we would pick against it, and that's what we did the uh, second game. But overall, are you satisfied with the way the game is went? Because like the early in the mid game, it was kind of close in terms of goals, and both teams were even, and only like the, in the later parts of the game, you managed to get so far ahead that you can close out the game. Yeah, I was expecting to go better. Like normally we're not playing against Nami that can heal the... What's really good in our composition is that Azir can poke in bot lane and the support that can heal like can counter that. Normally you're against Janna that can only shield or something like that. So we get a bigger lead in bot lane. Meanwhile, Chris Lund can get lead as well in Wargo top lane. So I, I expected to do better actually in the laning phase in the second game, but well, we did still uh, really fine. <laughs> Uh, tomorrow you're going up against CLG in the grand final. I know you guys were expecting to go against Rocket, and why do you think this semi-final ended up this way? Mm. Rocket had a really good uh, first game. The second game they tried something different with uh, Gangplank top lane. It didn't work really well and maybe then they, that's what had, um, snowballed in the third game as well. They had problems to, from the second game. And what ki what areas of the game are you gonna look into when preparing for this final match of the tournament? Mm, we we'll just do our style and like keep going like we did today and win. Well, I hope it work works out for you. And once again, congratulations on winning this game. It was Kabashard, Gamit Gaming's top laner. And thank you for watching this interview and follow the coverage at gamitgaming.com.